this house was owned by one of the most sinister characters in Hollywood history. George Hodel was an American physician who is best known as one of the main suspects in the Black Dahlia case that rocked Hollywood. Born on October 10, 1907 in Los Angeles, California, George showed that he was highly intelligent at a young age. He was a musical prodigy who graduated from South Pasadena High School at the age of 15 before starting college at Caltech. However, after having an affair with one of his professor's wives, he was forced to leave the university after only one year. In 1928, he had a common-law wife named Amelia, and together they had a son. In the 1930s, he married his second wife, a model named Dorothy, and together they had a daughter named Tamar. In 1932, he graduated undergrad at the University of California at Berkeley before attending medical school at UC San Francisco, where he graduated in 1936. By the 1940s, George was rubbing shoulders with Los Angeles' high society due to the success of his medical practice and position as the head of the county's social hygiene bureau. During this time, he became friends with photographer Man Ray, director John Huston, and became obsessed with the dark side of surrealism. George also became known for his partying and philandering. In 1940, he married his friend John Huston's ex-wife Dorothy, but called her Dorero to avoid confusion with his second wife. In 1945, he bought the Soden House, which was built in 1926 by Frank Lloyd Wright's son, Lloyd Wright. There he lived with Dorero and their three children, his second wife, Dorothy, and their daughter, his first common-law wife, Amelia, and sometimes temporary girlfriends that he had. So needless to say, it was a full house. In 1949, George's teenage daughter, Tamar, accused him of assaulting her, which led to a highly publicized trial where he was eventually acquitted. During the trial, Tamar claimed that her father had killed Elizabeth Short, aka the Black Dahlia, and he immediately came onto the police's radar. He was never formally charged with the crime, but is believed to have been the culprit by at least two of his children. His son, Steve Hodell, is a former LAPD detective who has written several books on his father's connection to the famous case. In 1950, George left the mainland U.S. and moved to Hawaii, where he counseled prisoners for three years before moving to the Philippines, where he started a new family. He returned to the United States in 1990, married another woman named June, and passed away in San Francisco in 1999. He has been connected to several other high-profile cases, but has never been formally charged. Today, his former home is a historical landmark that you can visit on Franklin Avenue in Los Angeles, California. Also, thank you to the Girls Next Level podcast, where I first learned about George Hodel and the Soden House.